Alright, here we're taking a look here at our Mark IV-A dropship wreckage here. Get this up to about 300 meters a second, because we use a uh, speed increase mod, of course. And what happened is we tried to do a hard landing at 300 meters a second on the ice, and ended up nicking kind of a uh, crack in the ice, basically. Took the cockpit out, and pretty much everything behind it damage is pretty rough. You'll notice that the uh, heavy armor spine is perfectly intact. In fact, everywhere the heavy armor spine runs is perfectly intact. Except for that tail, of course. Now, it did cartwheel about eight times and sent me flying out since we're in creative mode. We probably went about uh, 500 meters away from it by the time I was able to stop. As you can tell, the passenger seats, on one side at least, are still there. So, two out of five crew members would have survived this. Uh, primary thrusters are still there. Looks like the descending thrusters are still there. We've got reverse. We've got one directional, sideways it is. And we've got three-fourths of the uh, forward thrusters as well. All in all, it's very salvageable. What we need to do is just slap a cockpit on and uh, patch up some thrusters onto the... Uh, which side is that? On the left side here. And we would be able to take off again. Of course, we probably need to put some gyroscope in there. I think those are gone. Those were with the primary batteries right here. Yeah, those are just gone. I'm pretty sure we lost all the ammunition for the one remaining Gatling. Are definitely gone as well. We do have a battery though, which should give us just enough juice if we salvage that to get it back. Pretty sure the uh, no the solar panel is actually still there. So if we were to write this thing, which is no small feat considering we only have uh, two thrusters to climb with, we have to use the uh, mountain slope there to push it over. So if we were to write this thing, we could basically wait for daylight, charge the battery, and just carry on. I'm rather pleased with the design. It's held up pretty good. Most of the other ships I've seen and other ships I've used have pretty much fallen apart until I started using the uh, heavy armor spine there. And that just really seems to help keep ships together all when they crash on atmospheres, or just in general now. We'll do some more playing with that concept, and uh, let you guys know how that goes, of course. Uh, of course, as always, hope this helped one inspirational in some ways, and give a good day.